how cute is this outfit like so this is from Lulu. this necklace is from Shein and I had it on because I had another outfit on but I like it together purse and then these yoga pants are perfect they're from Addicted and then I have one the Burks I got for Christmas nothing really matches but it all coordinates and it looks really cute so anyway I'm about to go get my makeup done by Lauren she does makeup here on campus and she wanted to do my makeup so I agreed and that's what we're doing I need to fix my hair I really should have been like walking to the bus stop right now but I'm hoping to get this done like very fast because I don't be liking to play with people's time because I don't like people playing with my time even though I'm understanding but still just gonna leave the bottom like this because I don't have time to curl it hopefully it does not look crazy hey y'all what can I do to like make the curls like not be so tight because like the the front When it be coming out cute, then I want to keep it. But I don't want to curl no leave out every day. Oh, and tomorrow I'm going to the movies to see um, Mean Girls. I mean, hopefully that looks fine. I don't know. This is 13 minutes. Coming from that pretty mouth, the truth is steady. Cause you ain't never talking loud and you know plenty. You know what I'm talking about, cause you just get me. Yeah, you so pretty. If everything is tipped and go, then baby, it will never grow. Hi guys, so I'm starting my new vlog. I really liked my last vlog. I think it's okay to record when I'm not doing anything. Not doing anything translates to like not going somewhere, or like not doing maintenance, like just school stuff, work stuff, that's it. But I feel like I should do a mix and not just show, I don't know, like just show more. Cause I like to only show when I do stuff, not like, the regular days where I'm just at school and don't do anything so yeah y'all look how cute this outfit is <sighs> I can't isn't it so cute so this is like my shirt that I got from the bookstore my skirt is addicted got my bag my um my never full and then sambas so cute like this with a little white bow yeah but anyway I just turned in my autobiography I'm surprised I did it. <laughs> I don't know why. Because I was like procrastinating, 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 procrastinating. But I got it done. And it was very cute. But right now, I didn't go to stat, obviously, because I'm still here. So, luckily, she records each um, lecture. So, I'm going to finish what I missed today and turn it in. Um, so I don't have to worry about it because there's nothing worse than being behind. So I'm going to do this, watch the videos, and then I already started on my homework, but you have a five day grace period. So the, the soft deadlines due tonight at 11.59, it's 11.52, but you have five days and then it's actually due. So you can do it within those five days to make your score higher or if you just didn't get to it, which I feel like is so sweet. Like she gets it. I love a flexible professor, okay? Makes all the difference. But I did my research on her, okay? I did. But yeah, I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna pack, get all my stuff ready for tomorrow, like what I'm wearing, all of that. 
and yeah leaving tomorrow at 10 instead of 6 a.m because i always leave at 6 a.m but i'm leaving at 10 um because i don't have class tomorrow so i will see y'all back in the city at school Hi guys, so it is Saturday. I'm about to go to Union to do homework and to build this Lego for like some new scenery. But this is what I'm wearing. So this headband is Timu, Lulu, Addicted. And then I'm gonna wear these Golden Goose. And I'm trying to get my necklace to show, but it's like not showing. I need to change my battery because my battery's dying. Okay, this is where I'm at so far. This is like the whole frame. And you can actually hang it up if you want to hang it. Because it has like the little, you know, thing where you put the nail. Um, So now I assume we're just going to put these in each of the squares. And then we're going to make all of these. And so these are like customizable. You can make whichever one you want. I'm going to sort of kind of follow the picture. Definitely gonna do Tiana, definitely gonna do probably Minnie Mouse, not Mickey Mouse. Um Rapunzel's cute, but you can see there's 72 different ideas you can do in here. And if you're really Lego savvy, you could probably figure out how to make your own. But yeah, I might do Ariel, but I'll make her Hallie, not you know, <laughs> Ariel Ariel. Anyway. Um yeah, so that's where I'm at right now. We have the little Mickeys on the side, so so cute. Hi guys, so it is like 12.42. My sleep schedule is so bad right now. Like, I really need to get it together. I don't know. But anyway, I'm going home today. And y'all, I am like so hyped about canes. I haven't had canes since Miami. And it's really not all that. I gave it like a 7 out of 10. But it's like, you know like how you've been craving something? You just want it. And so, on the way, we gotta pass through Chapel Hill. So I'm like, we should go. It's my mom's birthday tomorrow since today's friday so i have um some stuff to do i gotta get my hair together and all of that but also i have to pick up her cake pick up balloons we're gonna have dinner and it's gonna be so fun and also i just got us tickets to this calligraphy class because she wants to get into calligraphy and so i was gonna get her like a calligraphy kit 
but I was like it would be more fun and like interactive and just like another memory for us to have together if we just do a class so I know she's gonna really really like that and I'm excited um my dad got her an iPad like I told y'all and she didn't really tell me anything that she wanted so that's what I came up with and I know that she's really gonna like it and she's gonna love her cake she's been talking about like a burn cake I know y'all know what I'm talking about it's been trending but she was talking about it for me like for my birthday this year but she has a burn cake and so I'm excited for that we're gonna all go out to dinner together and she's gonna be really special so I'm excited about that I got a pack I'm doing some homework early um just so that I can focus on her birthday and just enjoy like being home um and yeah so I'm probably gonna leave Monday morning at 6 I have stat and critical thinking on Mondays and I my class is at 1 so I can get there at 6 and still have like time before class so I think that's gonna be the plan and then I'm gonna start editing this video and also I gotta start planning for spring break so it's a lot going on but we're gonna be good like it would be way more convenient for me if I was just in school in Raleigh and I just think about that like a lot now because I'm always going back and forth but it's not like I don't hate it here but I don't love it either you feel me like it's not like I'm missing out on anything so I have met a lot of people here um obviously that I would not have met if I stayed in Raleigh but y'all I don't know I've been thinking about going home because I don't know like everyone really romanticizes moving or going away from home um when you move out or like when you go to college or whatever but for someone like me who's super family oriented and I love my parents and I love being at home and you know what I mean I don't know why sometimes I'm like I don't know why I did this like I wanted new scenery but I enjoy being home and I think that's a blessing because a lot of people don't and they want to get away from home and they feel like that's the only way that they can grow or be sane and because you know people have different issues like family issues things like that and I'm blessed to be able to enjoy being in that space and I don't feel I don't have negative experiences or like negative feelings towards being at home and so I don't know why like it would be so much easier if I was in Raleigh like bro so much easier not even on some like surface get your nails done, get your hair done type stuff like it just wouldn't be so stressful going back and forth and so it just makes no sense for me to move out here or stay in Charlotte because I go home so often. But that's my little rant about that. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> I don't know. Like I kind of low-key want to go home next year. I don't know. And like transfer, but I'm still thinking about it. And I don't have inspiration here. Like when I go out, sure. But half of the time I'm with like friends who are like kind of like we're newer kind of friends. So I don't like shoving my camera in people's face. Like I definitely feel like I should film more of my college experience. But I do think that I would be more comfortable if I was doing things at home. Like this is just my take on this. Like just because you see, because I feel like in some way, some way, somehow we're all influenced by the things that we see on social media. Like I don't care what you say, how you spin it. Like something is going to influence you, right? And so I toured this school and I really wanted to come here. But it's like, don't jump out there until you're ready. And take that how you want it, like, with anything. Just don't jump before you're ready. And I feel like this wasn't really that big of a jump because I'm only, like, two and a half hours away. But still, like, just do what works for you. I don't really know if this is working for me anymore because it's just, like, a hassle going back and forth. And I feel like it would just be much easier. And I would feel like I would put out way more content if I was at home because here I just feel so isolated, like... I have to go two and a half hours just to go home so I don't know like I just feel like not alienated because I do have friends but I just feel isolated here sometimes and it just makes it hard for me to like do what I want to do and I just kind of get caught up in like going to class eating going to sleep going to class eat go to sleep and it's kind of like the same thing but when I'm at home yeah it's the same thing over and over but I have way more inspiration for content and just like things that I can do and like all of that so yeah yeah it was eating like what
focus on me? Baby, can you focus on me? me? Is it so hard to That is so beautiful! Right, let it go, let it go. Let it go. Oh my it's god. Oh wow! Oh my god! Oh my god. That's too cool. That's too cool. What? <laughs> oh my goodness! That is so beautiful! Oh. <laughs> that is so cool! It is looking I've never seen it in my life. Do I still look humpy? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> I got a little cone. <laughs> All right, I gotta pick up some things at a Target. What's new? So far, I got these two. And I need, let me see my list. Oh, and I got some gel. And I need razor heads, deodorant, and mouthwash. I have a flamingo razor. So I'm gonna get these. I hope this is the right one. Is this the right one? I think I have this one, so these, right? I think so. All right, now I just need deodorant, and then I'm done. Oh, you do? Mm -hmm. Okay, come on. Okay, let's see. Everything. I'm gonna show y'all a haul when I get back. Okay guys, so I'm back from Target. I'm finna do a little haul, show y'all everything that I picked up. I didn't need a lot, um, but I just I just needed like a couple things to re-up for when I go back to school. And instead of doing Instacart like I always do, I was just like I'll just take this stuff with me in my bag. And I do bring a little um I'll show y'all, huh? I'm glad I got this because I'm going to take it downstairs so I don't forget. But I have one of these like keeps food cold or hot kind of bags. So if I do end up getting anything here while I'm in Raleigh, since I commute so much, 
um i can take it back with me you don't have to worry about it like spoiling or anything like that so as per usual i'm heading back tomorrow at 6 a.m so i'm gonna be up at like 5 5 30 ish to get ready sometimes i'll take a shower at night just so that i can sleep in longer but we'll see what i feel like doing i have two classes tomorrow stat and critical thinking so yeah and then i want to really go do pilates yoga something to move my body um this week so yeah let me get into the haul because i've been talking let me show you what i got so recently i went to trader joe's if you saw my last vlog and i got some butter chicken i did not do a grocery haul but next time i'm gonna do a grocery haul and show y'all everything from target and trader joe's that's where i get all my groceries or walmart half the time but anyway i say all that to say i got the butter chicken or i got tikka masala i don't know i got something but I didn't get any nine. So I found this and it's just some like, it's some garlic nine that I found and it's from Stonefire. And you just put this in your toaster or you can put it in the air fryer, I'm sure. So I can't eat my, my, my butter chicken without it. Like I was trying, but I was like, eh, it's not gonna get the same. So I'm glad I found this. And then I also got these little fruit. Mm. I cannot see when it's upside down like this. I got some fruit snacks. This is just some peach and mango coconut water. I don't even know, y'all. I just want to try it. As for like hygiene stuff, I'll show y'all what I got. Oh, I got these cute earrings. Like these are so cute. They're like these little doorknob, like door knocker heart earrings with a pearl at the top. And I thought these were super cute. So I got these. I needed more sugar scrubs, so I ended up getting the vitamin C one because I've been using my Naturium um, body wash. And it's a vitamin C body wash, so I got that one. And then I also got Coco Colada, which is, she's not new, she's true, okay? I've been using this one forever. I love coconut scented in like anything. So I got these two. I don't, I don't have room for this stuff. Let me let that, let me make that clear. I don't know where this is going, but it's going somewhere, okay? I did need it. I just have a lot of little hygiene stuff. I already let y'all know, like in my last video, I just have a lot of body wash and stuff I haven't really used yet, but I did not have any scrubs. Okay, I had none, so we can justify that. I needed more of these for my bathroom and for my room. Honestly, probably just for the bathroom because I've been using my white smelter again, and I have like a ton. I want to tell you a ton. I have a ton of white, like white smelts, different scents. And those are actually way stronger and obviously I have a lot of them so they'll last me longer than buying these. But I do like these for the bathroom. So I just got this one. I needed more razor heads so I got this one. I have a Flamingo razor which I love. It is such a good razor. Like I promise you the results looks like a wax. I kid you not. Um, their blades are just really really good. So I got four of these. I hope this is the right one though because I don't really know which razor I have but hopefully this is the right one I love this makes your skin glow and I, I just tell the difference like when I use my body lotions and like body creams and all of that without this it's just not the same like I like to be super super hydrated when I step out the shower so I got this I love this um I don't really like baby oil it's too greasy and oily for me so an uh, oil gel it just does it for me and then lastly i got mouthwash i needed more of this i did not need this however it smells really good and i feel like this would be really cute for the spring it's citrus amber i love amber scents so i mean why not and it's really cute i love this brand i really really love this brand it's such a fresh smell like this is like a i don't know i don't really know but just take my word for it okay I wouldn't lie to y'all. This smells really good. Go get it. They also have the lotion, but I do not like the consistency of this brand's lotion. It's like way too watery. Like if you've ever used Victoria's Secret lotion and like compare it to like Bath and Body Works lotion, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And it doesn't really keep you moisturized like the EOS or like Bath and Body Works. So I don't like their lotions. Their body mists are really good though. Kind of reminds me of Sol de Janeiro, except these last way longer. So. I do like this brand a lot. I haven't tried their body wash, but their body oil is also really good. I didn't see it in this scent, but if they did have it, I would have gotten it. So that's my haul. 
I'm gonna figure out how I'm gonna pack this up in my bag. But um, yeah, I feel like I should show y'all how I pack. I didn't really pack anything this time. I always pack way too much. Like I feel like I packed nothing this time, but I still somehow overpacked. And I didn't bring my coat, so imagine it's like 39 right now. Imagine how it's gonna how cold it's gonna be at 6 a.m. tomorrow with no coat. Um, I got this ice cream too. Hold on. It's the cream malicious. Now I saw the banana pudding one, but it was looking too yellow for me. You know, like mm -hmm. it look like it tastes like straight banana powder, straight artificial. So I don't have my tripod. Yet. I'm sorry. Hopefully, this is okay. Let me just back up. We're gonna see. I like that. This kind of reminds me of Jenny's. Let me see. This is good. I kind of let it melt too much. If you like caramel, get this. Why would I do that? This is so good. 10 out of 10, really. Polish ten toes down. Yeah. Look back at it, shot, he gon' look sit down. Tattoo, he can do the see through. Yeah. Body green color, I see. I'm trying to be more consistent. Seriously. Because I need to get on my Zoom. I don't know what's wrong with me. I think it's because I'm scared to vlog. Because I don't live alone. I know that y'all think that. But I have my own room. And it's a shared space. And so I feel super awkward talking to myself. Talking to a camera. And so that's why. And I just need to invest in a microphone. But I don't know if these cameras have mics that come with them. By the way, I have pimple patches on my face. So... 
they're so cute they're like hello kitty but anyway i'm editing the video y'all just saw and tomorrow i'm going to do calligraphy which is so fun it was one of my mom's birthday presents because she wants to get into calligraphy so that's what we're doing and we're probably gonna grab some food so i'm excited it's gonna be a whole thing i'm gonna do my makeup because i don't go anywhere so this should be fun um also i have to go grocery shopping i've really been into just cooking like i know y'all don't see it but i made like pasta tacos more pasta like i've just been cooking and i love it though it's fun and it's like rewarding and i'm just into it right now also y'all i'm watching the wink saga a lot of people said it's bad personally the Winx Club is like a fever dream for me. I don't really remember it like that. I remember seeing it on Nickelodeon and all that, but I never really watched it, so I don't know. But I'm liking the little reboot so far. Anyway, I'm editing this video. That's pretty much what I'm doing right now. It's 7.51, and I just have stuff to do. So I was going to take a nap, but I was like, get up and do something with your life. I look so cute. Like, it's just cute also i need to get my nails done so we'll probably do that tomorrow or on sunday it just depends i really need them done i don't know what i want i kind of just want french why is it like not focused on me and i'm gonna give y'all a room tour because my room is so cute this is my wallpaper. It's from Amazon. My grandma does my wallpaper. It's peel and stick. And then this is also from Amazon. I have an entire Amazon storefront with like pretty much everything that's in here linked. So y'all can access that whenever you want. Headboard, pillows. I'm sure my bedding is probably from Amazon. This, however, is from Target. All of my blinds are from Amazon. And this. You don't have to screw that one into the wall. I think we did <laughs> but you don't have to um these i cannot remember where those are from it's either amazon or like kohl's not kohl's i'm not talking about tj maxx home goods marshall something like that and yeah but i'm gonna get up and actually give y'all a room tour i feel like i should do it on tiktok so that's what i'm gonna do also i need a lot of i need to post more on tiktok like i just need to get on my zoom like i don't know bear with me this wig it's so cute um my normal gucci pendant and the matching ring this one's pandora gucci and then i have on my set from lulu that i got uh in january but it is so cute this is from steve madden it's like a little furry purse and then um shoes I know, 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 I